The answer to that question, like so many things in life, is it depends. It depends on the school that you're interested in attending, and it depends on the program that you're interested in applying to. So with that in mind, our first piece of advice for folks is to simply do some research on your own. Look into the schools and programs that you're interested in and get a feel for the average GRE score. That average GRE score is going to give you an idea of the target score that you're going to need in order to be competitive at those schools and programs. Now what you're going to notice is the score that you see is going to be on a range from 130 to 170. 130 being the worst, 170 being the best score you can get. You're also going to see two scores, a quantitative and a verbal score. In the verbal section, a 151 is a 50th percentile score. So if you want to do better than half of all of the people who are taking the GRE, you're going to have to get a 151 or better. In the quantitative section, a 152 or a 153 is 50th percentile. So if you want to be in the upper bracket, you're going to have to do better than that. For those of you who are looking to go to really competitive programs, you're going to want to be in the 90th percentile. In quantitative, the 90th percentile is a 165 all the way up to a 170, a perfect score. In the verbal section, in order to be in the 90th percentile, you're going to need to get at least a 162, and anything above that is going to put you in that 90th percentile. Again though, folks, what really matters is figuring out the score that is going to make you a competitive applicant at the school and the program that you're interested in. And with that in mind, go do some research and figure that out on your own.